All right, guys, so welcome back to another video. Thank you all for being here. I'm happy to be back, you know, uh, it's been a while. Anyways, guys, today we're going to be playing... Actually, I believe most of you already seen this thing, and I don't know if this was shown up in your recommendation or you just looked up for it. But nonetheless, uh, we're going to be taking a, taking a quick look at a game called Shrey. And I'm gonna just go ahead and start new game. I uh, supposedly an adventure exploration based semi open world something. And by these great developers, Annapurna. And. Well, guess what? The Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wow. Just... Just... Just who the fuck is in charge of this company, man? Who, who's behind this Anapan Interactive? Just coming up with nothing but beauty, man. Like, holy... Holy shit, the imagination. <laughs> what? Come on, don't hit him, hit him. Ah, that's so cute. Alright guys, so for those of you who are completely off, don't know what's going on here. This is, uh, as I mentioned, whatever, and um, the game's I suppose it's set in some sort of a distant future where human humanity is extinct and there's just just now robots all over the place and uh, and cats so we're playing the world of a cat and uh, yeah it's a pretty smooth game by the way and uh Wait, I get to make cat... I got a button just for... purring. Yeah, the, the visuals... absolutely stunning, man. I, I like it. I mean... Whatever Anapana Reactive comes up with, or did come up with for the past few years, was nothing but pretty. And story rich. So... There's no more people. And we're playing the role of a kitty. I think it's a kitty. Dude, the, the, the chat physics and mechanics is uh, pretty on point, isn't it? Alright, I gotta stop giving this more compliments before I ruin it. You guys wanna see some real stuff? Yeah, just the idea of playing as a cat in a distant future where, where humanity is extinct. It's just how could you refuse to play that? Inside what is that, a cat language or is it a futuristic robot language? What the hell was that? I feel like I could Take the graphics a bit higher. I'm like, I could turn it up a notch. I don't know. Not that I'm complaining though. Everything about this game is on point. And yes, the graphics too. And holy shit, the music. <laughs> so, I suppose we're just getting into us, man. We're just getting into the role of the cat. We're just getting familiar with the mechanics. What the what the hell? Ah, uh, so wait a minute. <laughs> oh, I can jump. I mean, I can run. 
This is nice. Can you we go up this one? I gotta be honest with you, man. That that's that's that's, that's look at that the, that brown white cat. That's just who wouldn't the both of these white brown and the brown white. They're both so pretty. So what am I calling them when I meow? Dude, this is giving me some Last of Us vibes, you know? Whoa. You're not gonna jump off this thing, are you? Come on. Come on, come on. This is... Oh, look at that little tongue. Stop! Cats don't need to drink so much water. I I, I suppose. Uh, let me just fix the camera a little bit. What is this? What is this? Occasionally, you get to actually, uh, I guess, interact with with the with the other cats, like 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 this. It's like for an instant, I saw dude. I can't quite remember what game. I played maybe not even that probably recently that they had this pretty sick yeah the last of us part two man I think the only difference between this and that I mean like Jesus just get down I mean not the only one but there's a there's a there's a there's gotta be um the main difference in genre, because they're both post-apocalyptic, whatever, is that you get to deal with zombies there, and here, I don't even know what. Apparently, we're just looking for food or whatever. Did I just backflip? Guys, bear with me for a second. Do not leave the video, because I believe this is just an introduction to something much more... Um, interesting. Like, holy shit. I don't want to say this thing. It's right at the back of my head. But I'm going to just go ahead and say it, man. Like, you wouldn't really need to do this. But, I feel like this would have... This just would feel like... Probably 20 times better if you were just playing the game when you were... Freaking high or something. Like, if you'd actually feel like a cat. Oh shit! Please, dude, come on. J f uh, I fucking no, dude. Do cats really do that? Ah, oh, shit! My leg broke off. They're calling me from up there. Wait, do cats really do do that? Do they call up? Uh, what the fuck, man? I just passed out again. What's in the garbage bag? What's it shaking? You guys see the garbage bag moving? What the fuck is that? What? What? <laughs> Were they just little robots? I mean, I've seen some weird shit in the trailers of the game. Oh, look at it licking its feet because it hurts. So I can't run right now anymore because I'm freaking injured. And holy shit, I just want to get this light off so I can look, get a better look at the monitor. Fuck! 
We're back. This is good. Does this game have achievements or whatever? Some... Man, it must have felt great to be, the, be a cat. Like, only she wouldn't like to just go through anywhere. Like, look at this. Could a person do this? Probably yes. I mean, this is just... What the fuck? What, what are those rats? Why, why, why am I looking at me mechanical rats? Dude, that doesn't even make sense. That does absolutely make zero fucking sense. This game is dog shit. I'm just kidding, guys. Alright, alright, all right, I have an idea. Hello? Dude, dude, this is great. What? Wait. <laughs> Alright. So, we are being monitored, actually. Why am I not just using the regular road? Alright. Like something tells me that those little shits are not friendly. Bro, is it just me? Or the lighting effect in the game is just on a whole other level? Like, holy shit, it's just... Like, the thing... That's just... What? Does that even mean? Ah, uh, water. Help. Uh, cha chapel? Chapel loop? Cha whatever. And then that the only the, the the letters help is uh is pointing there. What the hell might I have a feeling like if we go here there might be okay there's nothing here. Some sort of an achievement. Which we're gonna have to absolutely look for. You can't just get passed by this stuff. Wait, is that it? Uh, for a second I thought. Holy shit, it's a dead cat right over here. Wouldn't want to get me upset. Follow me. Wait, okay, this is making noise now. It's weird. It's weird. Alright, um. Uh, so. So, what I forgot to mention. And as you can see, guys, this is a puzzle-based. Uh, this is mainly a puzzle game. An adventure puzzler. Just pretty much the typical Annapurna Interactive games. And, man, they're good at it. These developers are so fucking good at this type of games, man. Jeez, I don't want to die. What's this? Oh, do you guys hear? Oh, okay. So I, I suppose, I'm gonna throw the the bucket into the fan. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that was weird. <laughs> it's just classic cat behavior, man. Throwing everything off the table and shit. Why am I doing this? Is this necessary? Can we fucking not risk my life? Come on, come on. That was pretty obvious. That was a shitty puzzle. And here we go. Da. <laughs> October 11 is when this whole thing went down, right? What year, though? This whole thing started to go downhill. 
Um, guys, if you made it so far into the video, do me a favor, drop a comment below. Say... <laughs> what the fuck? Really? We're doing this? Drop a cat, drop a comment. Say, I mean, leave it, leave it a comment. Dude, just write something, please, guys. Say cat for me, please. And, uh, was there, is there a point to this thing? Oh, we're gonna do it fast! That's enough, I guess. I heard they do this because they're... The paws get itchy or whatever. Does it... Does it happen? If I do it super... Talking to me, man. Looks like somebody actually put up all this stuff. Water for me right here. And uh some some friendly robot who's been helping a lot of cats. And somehow cats always know when somebody's helping them. I gotta... Wait, I, I thought... It, not sure, but I think it's on a 30 minute mark when my camera stops recording. Just so you guys know, but... What the fuck are those? They're stupid is what they are. Alright, this doesn't look good. Jesus. No. Just fucking kill them. And that's such a confusing music. That matches the game perfectly right now. Honestly, guys, I'm running out of things to say. I don't know. Game's getting... Game's getting fucked. Okay. These fucking things don't make sense. What's gonna happen, though, if I just... Jesus. What are they? That thing. Yo. This is so... What do you... What do you... What? They look like freaking Chinese candles that go in, on in air when you fire them or whatever. What the fuck, dude? This is so exciting! <laughs> Jesus, the music! Whoa, 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 whoa! These are like little things that grab onto you, like little leeches and things. In the, the cartoon, Mr. Incredible. What the fuck? The game's just become... Oh, no. The different thing, man. Alright, I gotta be careful. Can I jump? Stop! There's no jump button though, what the fuck? Jesus! I could have also go up, man. Yo, what the fuck are these leeches? No, no, they slow you down also. What the hell, man? Fuck, man. Fuck, what's going on? I was... Now I can... Alright. We gotta hurry up, man. Oh. I just meowed. Found a way. This is interesting, guys. This is like... Um, like, I don't know if this is... This is gonna lead to somewhere good. But uh, the idea of this thing... It's just so unique, so so interesting for a video. This is why you make video games. This is why you should fucking make... I don't know how long this game will take to beat, but... This is, this is nothing but pure joy here, man. Innovation, fucking story, music, atmosphere. What else there is, man? This is why you make video games. So we can explore things.
Alright, I would assume we're going there. Alright, something... This is just water. So many different colors, man. So many different colors. I remember... Before this game were to come out, were to be released, uh, developers actually deleted a couple times. And so... It just... To me right now, it just seems like it, all of that effort has, uh, has worked. So I, I think we're gonna do this. It was kind of obvious. And we're gonna get up. Yeah, so... Whatever they did, I mean, like, it seems to be, seems that it has paid off, man. Um, like, I've, I've so far encountered zero malfunction, bugs, or anything. I'm kind of, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. Shoot the kitty out of me. Go, little kitty. Everything about this fucking thing is on point. There's gotta be some higher power who was aiming for something greater than a video game here. And that is so much appreciated. I fucking love that. When somebody brings life into a video game. Come on. I thought that's another another bucket or whatever. We're gonna take this with us, just in case. The flat. Am I hearing music? It says, we need help. Wait. Wait. You know what I think? This is... I'm not gonna do this anymore. It's so stupid. <laughs> no. <laughs> Shit, it reminds me of the cat playing the piano. Alright, alright. Body record. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What if we go... What? The fuck did I just do? Let's open a door. Dude. Wait, what is this? Is something? Don't fucking do that. Are we typing some more stuff? This is such an interesting idea, man. Now, my, my thoughts are... I don't know about you guys. Yeah, okay. Oh, fine. Okay. We're gonna be putting this. My thoughts are that somebody needs really help. Right? Like... I don't know. Put put it in... These. Idiot. Somebody needs help. And there, was that the only one that... Okay, we need three more. Somebody... Some robot needs help. Because something happened to him. I guess. I would assume. And... Uh, this also... This work, it's supposed to be working. This, is, this looks like it's all working. Through sign language or whatever. Now... I'm gonna take this out. Put it in here. Because it seems like it's the right thing. There's one more here. We're gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna Alright, there's another one there. Because why not, you know? 
So. Am I right? Did I just... Putting that. What is that even? What did I pick up? Oh, it's like a. It's like an eyepiece. This thing is. Okay, so this... Wait. Jesus. I'm gonna go back to the other room for a second. Looks like it. Wow, it's just so smooth, man. This thing. Something tells me there was some Japanese dude in charge of imagining all this whole thing. I don't know. <laughs> Fucking cats. The freaking just moves the, the cat the way the cat moves its paws and whatever. It worked, I'm free, thank you. I couldn't believe the camera as a cat in the dead city. Um I can't remember my name, it seems my memory is corrupted. I've been trapped in the electronic network for so long. I know it worked for a scientist. I know I worked for a scientist who left here. For now, you can call me B12, like the vitamin. That's what it says on my exterior. Yeah, where is your exterior? It's dangerous in the dead city, but just... <laughs> Let's get out of here. Follow me. Wait. What the hell? The key unlocks the door. I remember that match. Let me get that for you. Did it. The keys. Battery low already. Come here. Alright. So this is pretty much... Uh... Wait. What was this? Oh, okay, so this was... You're going to have to put this on. Put what? Whoa. What? <laughs> What? Whoa! What? What did you? Wow, it's heavy. It's actually pretty heavy. This backpack was designed for small quadrupeds, like you. Right? It is. <laughs> Don't worry, you will get used to it. I've digitized the key and stored it in the backpack. Press to open the inventory. Alright. Easy. If you're ever curious about an object, you can show it to me. Or to others if we come across any. Now let's get out of this flat. Can I still do this? Alright. Now the story seems to be revolving around me escaping this thing, I guess, so that I can get back to my friends. If I'm guessing. Maybe. 
Whatever. We got the key, use the item. And it's gonna be... Wow! Oh fuck, that's so bright. The cat playing piano. Alright. This is gonna be one of those games that's gonna have a lot of ups and downs. It, it seems that way. What code, dude? Do we have to find a code? What the hell happened? Oh, wait. There's gotta be a code here. The code is, it says right here. Two, uh, three, seven, forty-eight. Three, seven, forty-eight. Three. Easy. We need to get out of this apartment. Yeah, it's, yeah. Let's try the main door. I should be able to open it. Oh, look at this place. Elevator with a distance, that's important, I think. I know we need to go up. What the freak has happened to the city? Anyway, guys, um, I think it's a good, good idea to leave it right here. Call it quits. I hope you enjoyed the video. I thoroughly enjoyed the whole thing, to be quite frank. And this was such a good, such a nice game. Like, uh, I was pretty excited to give it a try. I didn't know quite exactly what it's all about. But honestly, it's exactly what I thought it would be. And I'm just so happy that I finally, when, even though it's been a, been a while since the game was actually out. Anyway, guys. Uh, let me know what you think about this one. If you want to see the rest of the video, uh, I will definitely come up with that in case you guys, if anybody asks, I'll do that. Thank you for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys again soon. In the meantime, take care, y'all. Peace.